Somebody. Yeah, I love candy. But welcome to Everybody Loves K. It's your boy K Knight. Thanks for tuning in. Um, today we're going to talk about some foolishness. There's a bunch of foolishness going on between the Wounded Warriors Project, Cat Williams, all kinds of stuff. We're going to get into it. Let's go. Okay, anyways, um, so you got this dude, right? Um, well, let's start with the Wounded Warrior Project. So you got the Wounded Warrior Project. This is it's a good thing, and it helps Wounded Warriors that's come back from Iraq or the war or whatnot, and it helps them get back on their feet. But lately, they've become under investigation because some idiots want to take the money that they're supposed to be spending on the veterans and use it for themselves. Over about four years, they spent about $800 million of the charity money on themselves, on hotels, partying, and such. Two people have been fired. The CEO and the COO has been fired because of it. <clears throat> Bunch of foolishness. It's like, why? You're supposed to be helping people, and instead of doing what you're supposed to do, you're taking the money and partying with it. Then you got this dude, Cat Williams. They can't ever behave in and out of jail, punching people in the stores, in the convenience stores. It's a bunch of foolishness going on. And it's like, I understand that people are in the spotlight or whatever. We hold them to a higher power, to a higher, you know, a higher standard or whatnot. But as a figure that many people look up to, like Cat Williams and Johnny Manziel, because that fool can't never stay out of trouble either. You got to do better. You got to do better for yourself. You got to do better for your family. You got to do better for your fans. And it's just ridiculous how people act these days. But um, that's all I got for today. Um, let's see. So the whole thing is, my main whole main thing is, if you're going to be in the spotlight, if you're going to be famous and stuff, at least try to... Um, you know, behave more. If you're going to be in a position to help other people, do the right thing. It seems like can't nobody act right these days. I don't know what's going on. Folk want to fight, and then Cal Williams want to call out other comedians and stuff, and it's like, dude, don't get mad because somebody else is more successful than you. you your butt can't stay on, out of trouble. He going to call out Cal, what, uh, Kevin Hart. And try to put him on blast and call him all kinds of names and say that he's been a puppet, this, that, and the other. Dude, you can't even stay out of trouble. Why, um, you was in movies too, but you hating on this dude because he's so successful. Kevin Hart works hard, and he works hard for a reason. But you don't see him get, punching people in the face and getting arrested and all that. Uh, Johnny Manziel still partying, still staying out of trouble. And the Browns still have not released him. I just don't know why. I, I really don't know why the Browns haven't released him. You would have thought by now they would have let that dude go. He'd probably been in Dallas somewhere. I don't know. But he, he's still acting a fool, but whatever. And it's just um, just a bunch of foolishness going on in this country right now. And I mean, I know people get in trouble every day. People go through stuff. It's just no, like normal people who go through that stuff every day. But their business don't get blasted all over YouTube and the Internet and, uh, and Facebook and all that like these guys do. So... I don't see, you don't see Peyton Manning out there acting a fool. You don't see, you know what I'm saying? You don't see other people out there acting a fool like Johnny Manziel is. You don't see other comedians out there acting a fool like Cat Williams is. And then you got this charity, and it's like the another charity since that, um, that one charity they did for those people um, in other countries. I forgot what it was called. Um, and they uh, did an investigation and busted them for um, some type of scandal. But then you got these Wonder, Wonder Warrior people that is just robbing people like crazy. I mean, they're getting all this money, accumulating all this money, and they accumulated like $24 million in 2014. And But over a span of four years, about four years, they spent over $800 million on themselves, on selfish reasons. It's ridiculous, but whatever. All I'm saying, people, is we got to do better. We, we got to do better. We got to set an example for the next generation because they're coming up and they don't know no respect. 
and it's getting ridiculous. I was having a talk with some guys earlier about, you know, when we was growing up, we got our butt whooped for almost everything we did. Nowadays, kids getting a timeout. And they ain't learning nothing from timeout, man. Well, it's, it's, it's whatever. We gotta do better, we gotta be more respectful. And we got, and there's always a camera watching. There's always in the camera watching. Just assume there's always a camera watching. Assume there's always somebody investigating if you're in business. You know what I'm saying? But um, that's all I got for today. I ain't really have nothing in the first place. So all I gotta say is I love y'all. Thank y'all for watching. Please subscribe. And as I always say, everybody loves K, and I love y'all too. Have a good one.